Your Majesty Otomfu Osei Tutu II, the Asante Hene. Her Majesty Nana Konadu Yadom III, Queen of the Asante Kingdom. Your Excellency Wavel Ramkalawan, President of the Republic of Seychelles. Honorable Shelley uh, Boshao, Minister of Foreign Affairs. Your Excellency John Kofu, former President of the Republic of Ghana. Your Excellencies, Ambassadors, members of the Dipl Diplomatic Corps, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, I have the privilege and responsibility to deliver these remarks on behalf of His Majesty King Swati III, King of the Kingdom of Eswatini. Allow me to begin these remarks with a message of regret from His Majesty at being unable to be with us here due to long-standing annual commitments. His Majesty King Swati III, the Queen Mother, the government and the people of Eswatini would like to convey their best wishes to His Majesty Otumfu Osei Tutu II, the Asante Hene and the people of Asante as we celebrate 100 years of the return of Nana Akiyama, Prempe I, the Asante Hene, from his period of exile in the Seychelles. Today, we not just celebrate the return of a leader, but we celebrate the resilience and strength of the Asante people. Nana Prempe I was not just a king, but a symbol of unity and perseverance. His journey has taught us that even in the face of adversity, we must hold on to our identity, our values, and our dreams. His return signified a new chapter of the Asante Kingdom, a time of rebuilding, strengthening bonds, and embracing the future with courage. Your Majesty, it has been nine years since His Majesty Otomfu Osei Tutu II, the Asante Hene, visited the Kingdom of Eswatini. His Majesty King Swati III has formed memories of the visit by the Asante Hene. During his visit, the two monarchs resolved to strengthen relationships between the two kingdoms and countries. They agreed to frequent reciprocal visits. However, Ghana has had up to date not received His Majesty King Swati III. It is His Majesty's wish to reciprocate the visit in the near future. The monarchs also pledged to promote cultural exchanges between the two kingdoms and countries by embracing cultural diversity and preserving cultural heritage. Recently, a delegation from the Kingdom of Eswatini was in Ghana for a week for the purpose of merging of traditional local administration and modern local government, as well as the administration at establishment of the National Houses of Chief. The government of Ghana provided technical assistance and warmly welcomed the delegation from the Kingdom of Eswatini. Your Majesty, allow me to recognize the good relationship between the President of the Republic of Ghana, His Excellency Nana Ado, Dankwa Akufo Ado, and His Majesty King Swati III. The President of Ghana and His Majesty King Swati III have maintained strong bilateral relations between our two countries from which we can gain access to important brotherly and cultural relationships that have a considerable potential of uniting us as Africans 
and for the development of our people. Eswatini wishes to affirm the strong and cherished relations between our two nations today as we celebrate not just the history that binds us, but the bright future we are creating together. Our countries have faced challenges and triumphs, yet through it all, our friendship has stood the test of time. This partnership is rooted in shared values of respect, equality, and commitment to uplift our people. Ghana and Swatini have much to learn from one another, from our rich cultural heritages to our vibrant traditions. We share a commitment to fostering peace stability, and prosperity. Our collaboration in various sectors, such as trade, education, health, culture, and sports, has already made significant strides, and there's still so much more to harness. Your Majesty, I'd like to express my appreciation for the warm welcome and hospitality that you have extended to me they are Royal Highnesses that we are with here today and my delegation during our stay here in Kumasi. We wish you continued prosperity and success as you lead the people of Asante to greater hearts. I thank you.